Computerized law enforcement sounds like something out of dystopian sci-fi, but law enforcement agencies are already using algorithms to fight crime. These algorithms are designed to figure out where and when crimes are likely to occur. It's called predictive policing. This is Algorithmics, the space where we explore how invisible, computer-controlled, database sets of rules are making decisions for us every day. Combating and preventing crime often comes down to identifying patterns, which can be difficult for humans sifting through thousands of case reports. But it's much simpler for a computer. In predictive policing, data-centered analytical techniques powered by algorithms can help officers identify where and when crime is most likely to occur. Predpol is one of the largest companies in this space, and they use three data points, crime type, location, and time and date, to build customized crime predictions. Everything is built on the observation that certain types of crimes tend to cluster in time and location. So first, the system processes years of crime data in a location to get a historical view of crime patterns. It does this through an algorithm called the Epidemic Type Aftershock Sequence Model. Catchy. Then, at least once a day, Predpol pulls the three data points in from a feed of police department's records. As new crimes occur, they're mapped against existing patterns, and Predpol's prediction engine attempts to figure out when and where similar crimes are likely to occur. But algorithmic law enforcement isn't just about policing. It's also been used in parole decisions to assess an inmate's risk of recidivism. According to the Wall Street Journal, parole boards in at least 15 states have used these types of tools. We're not at the point where cops are being replaced with computers, but today, part of the long arm of the law is the algorithm. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.